Hello everyone, I'm Pacific the Casual Gamer, and welcome back to the Oblivion New Builds. This is where you've picked a race, but you kind of don't know what kind of build you want for this race. And you're a noob, you're kind of afraid, because Oblivion doesn't explain things. So today, we're going to talk about the Imperial. Now the Imperial, this is a quick side note, is what I consider the all-rounder character. The character that you just kind of pick, that really doesn't do anything, except gives you a blank slate to experiment. So this character, excellent for experiments. Before your stuff, your sign is gonna be the lady for the endurance and willpower. You're gonna pick stealth specialization. So right off the bat, you got three bases covered. And your two attributes are gonna be endurance and willpower. Normally you have seven major skills, but I'm gonna give you four. The other three, I would like you to shove in just skills that you wanna experiment with. So if it's block or blunt, or some magic, go for it. Your four skills are gonna be Blade, Merchantile, Heavy Armor, and Restoration. Now, if you wanna go with Maces, swap out Blade for Blunt. But this character is kinda built for you to learn, but also, it's just kind of like, let's take everything overpowered and put it together. So, except for Merchantile, Merchantile's weird. So, Merchantile's there so that you make more money on the things that you go get from raiding. This character is excellent for dungeon raiding. Like just in general, you have the blade and the heavy armor. So blade it or, or blunt. And heavy armor is really good for combat and you have restoration so that you don't die. What's also nice is you have willpower. A lot of willpower. Um, you, I mean, you have it from the lady and the attribute. So even though you might not have a lot of magic, it's gonna recharge fast and allow you to cast extra spells that you normally couldn't in every combat situation. Plus, you're gonna have a lot of endurance, which means that, well, you're gonna have more health. Endurance is like the insane cru de gras attribute that you always level up to 100 because it gives you health. And because of the stealth specialization, if you decide to experiment with sneaking, it's gonna be a little bit easier because you're not gonna have like five sneak and just be a freaking ogre trying to sneak up on a like ninja, that, that that never works. It will never work. And over sneaking up on a ninja never works. And that's it for this build, guys. If you see, you know, with this character, especially with this character, if you want to experiment with magic, go for it because that high willpower is really going to pay off. Your magic regen is going to be really good. And you're going to be able to experiment with different types of spells that, you know, maybe you wouldn't experiment with otherwise. The, the spells in this game can get very kind of not complicated it just takes a little bit of time to learn it's like easy to learn but it takes time and having willpower and being able to cast those spells in combat situations just makes it easier to learn and that's really it ask me any questions you have in the comments below we have a community of oblivion players that will also answer them oh i almost choked on my own spit i'm pacific the casual gamer i suck just as bad as you do at video games and I will see you in the next episode, stream, vlog, or steam a post of whatever I decide to make.